Hello everyone, welcome to the channel, Rat here from Rat Kutsarot and this is going to be Sagittarius Sun, Sagittarius Moon and Sagittarius Rising monthly tarot reading for October 2018. And uh, while I'm doing the shuffling, I want to remind you guys that this is a, a general reading for Sagittarius star sign. This is not your personal reading. Therefore, in this uh, following spread, I will... <clears throat> explain you the meanings of the cards as well as I'm going to do the synergy in between them and in between the representative positions but it falls to you to make sense of them and to align them to your personal situations throughout the month so uh, if you want me to do that for you well that is a, a subject of a personal reading and for personal readings you can check out my website which is listed down below in the description of this video or um, yeah, you can make an inquiry into the email, which is also uh, listed down below in the description of this video. And as well, um, <clears throat> if you like these reports and you want to uh, know even more about your star sign uh, for the month, uh, there is an extensive reading that you can purchase for dollar forty nine. Again, my website, and there we specifically focus on two spreads for career and for a relationship. So that being said, going to the tarot spread for the month, this is a five card spread. The first card will display um, <clears throat> the situation or how or what the month is going to be the second car represents the intentions the best possible course of action you know what will be beneficial for you etc etc the third card is about the challenges which are causing predicaments for you sagittarius for the month the fourth card here it's about the resources that you can utilize and capitalize on or in other words what will help you throughout the month and the last card it's about the final outcome or what will be the result of the previous four cards so let's see what will be the topic the immediate thing so this is going to be a a month of stillness a month of uh, I don't want to say a stoic situations but it kind of this is a, a month of uh, of, of kind of like of a, a big process of one obtaining an insight because the hangman on a very superficial level it does represent delays it does represent uh, no movement whatsoever you know everything is in stillness and no matter how um, no matter how big efforts we do or how much we try to put the situation back in stir seemingly nothing will work out according to our um, acceptance and according to our perception. That's why the hangman is very important to be taken <clears throat> as a condition rather than as something that it is carved in stones. As a condition the hangman says a couple of things. First thing it says that uh, we need to or you Sagittarius needs to kind of like try to adopt different perspective. It is always different perspective about the hangman. Therefore, things aren't working out. Should they not work out? It is because you are not trying them from a different angle, should I say that way. So to give you an example to make that a little bit, uh, a little bit easier to understand is that... <clears throat> let's let's uh, take that you are single and you do have a, a person of interest here that you are chasing and for some reason things aren't working out obtaining different perspective here would mean that you are not attacking this person and attacking in a positive sense you know that you're trying to mesmerize them or enthrall them with the appropriate means you need a different perspective you need to kind of like you know adopt a, a different vision upon the situation and then uh, it is likely that you will realize why that person isn't isn't budging out and what you can do you know so you can put your situation with that person back in stir and the other thing is that if nothing really works out then the hangman is a card of waiting you know the sky is dark and will be put in light again only thing that you need to do is just wait so if you don't have to do something it is best for you to do nothing so this month for you Sagittarius is only the things from utmost importance needs to be attended just finding yourself something to do will be will turn out to be rather despondent and aggravating 
And so the best possible course of action here will be uh, the Queen of uh, the Queen of Wands. And this card uh, in that specific position asks you to uh, have fun generally. So attend into those meaningless enterprises and activities which one kind of tries to do when one is feeling that nothing else is working out, like uh, spending time with friends, you know, going out for a cup. For, for coffees, beverage, um, you know, gathering up with a, a, a family friends, for example, or making gatherings with a, a faithful companions of yours just to chatter, just to hang out, just to have to regain back that knack of sense of life that you may have recently lost. This is about the Queen of Wands. The Queen of Wands really knows how to, uh, how to have a good time, how to make fun, of any situation and the most important here for, with the queen of wands is that she knows um the very prof uh, the very profound foundation of the human nature so <clears throat> you have to kind of like uh, uh make a, a, a collection a selective collection of the people that you are interacting with so even though you may not be able to do much about your current undertakings this month Sagittarius you can take it as a month of a spring cleaning in your social circle with that queen and also what the queen points is that you may take a um, you may um, uh, I'm trying to find the best sentence here excuse me guys um, you may kind of utilize your acute business sense, all right, and scratch out a, a plan how you can improve your uh, financial state and how you can establish probably a private business furthermore into the future. Now, the next card here is going to be about um, the challenges which are causing predicaments. And we do have the page of pentacles and that would be a person that you have to tackle with. This person, very slow, wants to be kind of like a, a, a meticulous in their approach and so slow to the, a certain point, they're kind of scraping down your nerves. And it doesn't look like that with this person you can really kind of come to a terms where a certain motion needs to be led. So if this is a, about your career, that would be a person and there that you have to work with and they are so slow with their performance and with their approach upon the project that they themselves are causing even additional delays upon the work that you have to do and you have a couple of versions as I said you you can either adopt a different perspective and just you know <clears throat> try to push the project from a, a different angle where that person cannot really infiltrate with your work or you can simply wait out that person to finish their job which is again involved into the hangman and while in the meantime while doing so you should not bring your work at home or your work at your social circle and you can really have fun with either into your career or with within your relationship excuse me or within your uh, social circle where you have fun with your friends and <clears throat> it is very important here to realize that with the page of pentacles this person rather wants things to be uh, attended to even the finest and minus detail in there and it is why this is causing such an issue with the deadline of a specific project you know enterprise into one relationship or activity into one social circle and then the next card is uh, it, it regards to the um, resources that you can rely on Sagittarius is this card points that first of all uh, actually <laughs> this is very fortunate that we do have the um, the Empress and the hangman here as a um, core card as a court or as a card of a current situation as a situation throughout the month which means that the delays will not cause a, a severe negative impact upon your undertakings and upon your doings the hype the the empress here first of all points that despite of that there are going to be delays you know and despite that you may kind of like face a wall into certain undertaking of yours this will not cause a, a distortion into the um into the accomplishment of the final goal should i say that way or the benefits that the final goal is going to give you uh, and as a matter of fact the empress here as a um 
as a resource it says that you have all the time in the world um, for you to kind of like create your plans you know take decisions that you have to by detaching yourself from that stressful situations and especially from this person going into let's say a seclusion or a solitude should I say that way and kind of make a mature decision how to proceed on forward very important by adopting by obtaining excuse me the different perspective upon the things so most likely why things aren't aren't moving out in your in this month for you Sagittarius should they not move out it is because you are not consider a certain option available and in order for you to consider a certain option available you have to withdraw from the situation have some fun with your friends as we say withdraw from that person which is causing delays there and really aggravates you and then by you doing so then an, a, a correct decision that needs to be uh, made will become obvious for you and the last card here is show it shows the final outcome we do have the death card so that is complete change of scenery that we do have there finally things are set back on stir so throughout the month the delays will be dropped somewhere at probably at the end of the month well you can speed up the process by um attending to these couple of conditions having fun here you know and also trying to kind of like detaching yourself from the stressful situation so you can make a mature decision uh, by clinging to those uh, to those conditions you will speed up the manifestation of the death card which points to complete change of scenery as i said where the hangman will be no longer so you will um, you will finally see the the darkened sky being set on light again and most likely um, you know all of your situations which previously faced war will be set back on stir either into your career or either into your relationship so uh, just to summarize all that guys uh, for what I can see in this reading is that you need a, a bit of a rest here you need a bit of a um, a, a good time with friends with family you know with a um, beloved people as well so you can truly kind of decide where you want to go from now on and how exactly you have to get there for me looking at that reading this is the only thing that prevents you from doing it just knowing how to get there and uh, taking those um, decisions of what kind of means you need to get there and as well you know um, how well that is difficult to explain but how comfortable you will feel at the end of it and as soon as this is defined for what it seems there will be nothing that will obstruct your drive to achieve it so that being said Sagittarius this was your monthly tarot reading for October 2018 I hope you enjoyed it and you liked it and again guys this was a general reading for Sagittarius star sign this was not your personal reading therefore I have explained you the meanings of the cards I have explained you the synergy in the spread but it forced you to make sense of them and to align them to your personal situation if you want me to do that for you in a personal reading then you go to my website which is displayed down below in the description of this video and there you're going to find a full list of my services as well as their pricings Rat signing out now see you next time bye